Hey guys, what's going on? I'm Eric Surf Six, and today I'm being joined by Mega Brand Six Thousand One Hundred. And where are we going today, Mega Brand? Who's you, Highland? What, what's that? What's there? It's the best roller coasters. The best roller coasters. All right, get some. The first meal of the day. I got my MCD on. Whatever that means. Oh, it's a McDonald's. I haven't had McDonald's in ages. So I got this. It's the sausage egg muffin. Yeah, I haven't had one of these in ages. Really, really looking forward to this. So uh, I got the set that comes with uh, coffee. Comes with coffee and also uh, hash brown. straight. Yeah. All right, here it is. I'll give you a look inside. There's the egg. There's the meat. Cheese. Oh yeah, that looks good. Yeah, to me this, this is the best. This is the absolute best thing for breakfast at McDonald's. Although I don't really know what I'm talking about because I haven't eaten at McDonald's like I just said in a long time, but sausage, egg, muffin. It's a classic. Well, get a shot of Fuji. Look at that. All right, beautiful. Look at that. Beautiful. Japan's highest peak. 3,776 meters. Oh, yeah. Oh. I had to pay money. How much is it? 530 yen. 530. You just throw it into the hopper. All right. Clear. Let's finish this up. Polish this off. This is tasty. I love the taste of the sausage. Uh, so good. So, so good. Yeah, to me, McDonald's breakfast rules. Yeah, it's way better than eating lunch or dinner there. Yeah, all about the breakfast, McDonald's. Mm -hmm. And the uh, cost for this is 490 yen, so for the whole set. So $4.50. And it also comes with the... Uh, hash brown and a cup of coffee. Yeah. All right, we're in a tunnel. This is exciting. I hope you guys can see this. This is the hash brown right here. I love me some MCD on hash browns. Oh, salty, greasy, perfection. Ah, oh, so good. Really, really good. Oh man, you know, I mean, I also like McDonald's fries. I'll admit, they're really good, but this is definitely special as well too, for breakfast. I think I'd rather have this for breakfast than the fries. The fries are a bit heavy, this is lighter. So, yeah, way to go McDonald's. And this is a coffee, otherwise known as Mc, Mc Cafe. Mac Cafe, how do you say it? Mc Cafe, that doesn't sound cool. It's freaking coffee. Oh, yeah. It's pretty strong, actually. Yeah, this is good coffee. Oh, that hits the spot. Pretty good size, too. For Japan, usually the sizes are much smaller. This is, you know, this is a good medium size for sure. They come standard with the set, so, yeah. All right, so I'm gonna give this meal a, a quick rating, just a, a mini rating, all right? Because um, this, this video is gonna have a lot of, of food in it. So right away, I'm just gonna rate this. I'm gonna give it a perfect six, because I haven't had McDonald's in so long, and their breakfasts really are amazing, I think. So because it's a six-star perfect ranking, that's a nom 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 in Eric speak, I am giving away three of the Get Some Snack Packs. So the link's up here. 
Uh, if you want to know what's inside, you can check that out. And the way it works, if you're not familiar, is you leave a comment on this video, and I choose three winners that will be announced in the next video. Coming out of the tunnel, go ahead and leave a comment right now, or you can go ahead and wait to the end of the video to do it. But yeah, let's go ride some roller coasters. We're almost there. It's about two minutes away. Yep. Oh, man. I'm not feeling, to tell you the truth, guys, I'm not feeling so hot right now. That sausage, that, that sausage McMuffin is not sitting too well in my stomach. I think I'm going to revise my rating. I'm going to give it, uh, I'm going to give it a meh. It's not a six, it's a three. So, I'm taking away the snack packs. <laughs> okay, so, sorry. But they'll be back later probably, okay? So keep watching. We are at the entrance right over here. Right over there. Fuji Q Highland. Oh yeah. Best roller coasters in Japan and some of the best roller coasters in the world. This place holds some some Guinness Book records, actually. This place holds some Guinness records, actually. Yeah. More about that later. Parking costs. Single Hegwen. That's about $14. 500 yen back. It's like five bucks, five dollar coin. That's what I like about Japan. The coin values are high. All right, got the car parked. Now I'm gonna show you guys a really cool little trick that you can do in your car. Well, actually it happens sort of outside the car. So check it out. the coolest thing you've ever seen? It is actually New Year's Day today, but you're gonna be seeing this a bit later because uh, I've got a lot of editing to do. So once again, Happy New Year. We're at the entrance, gonna get tickets. Look at these beautiful decorations. And dig that New Year's music. It's got the Thomas trains. Look at that. Beautiful. Look at this. Yeah. Oh, smells unbelievable. Bamboo here. Yeah, gorgeous. All right, let's get some tickets. This is the wait times for the rides. 90 minutes to wait for the top two roller coasters. But we got all day. I think we can do them both. You get in by QR code. Yeah. Nice. All right, here we go. The first vending machine of the day. It's Thomas. Thomas train stuff. No, thank you. And what? Coming right up. What are these things? Oh, they're oh, they're little um, lanyards to put around your neck, and you can put your pass in it. Do we need to buy these? They're some Biaguen. Three bucks. No thanks. We'll just lose them and have to pay thirty bucks all over again. So this ride right here behind me is called Cool Japan, and it's interesting because it used to be called tsunami but because of the tsunami that happened in japan in 2011 they changed the name did you get that yeah did we time that just perfect or what wow here it goes here it goes oh no oh oh, oh. 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 Yeah, that's pretty cool. Yeah, it's pretty cool. Better than I remember it, because I don't remember it at all. <laughs> Ten years ago. Yeah. So that was cool, Japan. I thought it was pretty cool. And what we're gonna do today is we're gonna rate all of these rides. Every ride, we're gonna rate it just like my meal time ranking, one to six. So you go first, Mega Brian. What are you gonna give cool Japan? A uh, three. A three. Yeah. A meh. 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 Okay. I think I'd give it a four. It makes num. Yeah. I the only thing the only thing I don't like about it is it's just over so fast. There's not much to it, right? Yeah. Yeah. Is that what you thought too? Yeah. Okay. Let's go find a better ranking ride. So uh so what do you want to ride next? 
teacups. You want to have a flower tea party? <laughs> nah. <laughs> what are you doing there, Mega Brain? What does what that kanji character say on its belly? It says keen. Keen. Oh, that. That means money, right? Yeah. Is there good fortune? It means he's got some treasure or something. What, what, no way. There's money in his mouth. Jesus, that's a hundred dollar bill. Happy New Year, buddy. I think I'm going to buy myself a Super Bowl. I haven't owned a Super Bowl in many, many years. 200 yen. They used to cost a quarter, I remember. Two dollars now. Oh, it's gonna go down the thing. This is gonna be really cool. It's gonna be really cool. I got it. This is the one that I would like to get. The yellow, what is it, a cat? Or this one, this one's cool too. It's like a, what is it, like a ghost? I'm not sure, either one of those. All right. Are you feeling lucky? It's New Year's, I'm feeling lucky. All right, here we go. Ready? Button. Stop though. <laughs> Got my money back. <laughs> it says, Nimai. Two coins. Nimai ire de. Hi, look up. Two coins. And then you turn it. Push the button. It's too hard. I can't figure it out. I can't figure out Blue's Clues. Somebody help. Once more and then we'll ask the staff. Three strikes and you're out. Okay, since it's New Year's I get four strikes. Got a hundred yen back. I got a hundred yen back. <laughs> Did you see what happened? I got a hundred yen back. This only cost me a buck. So I got half off. It was worth the wait. So I got the, this isn't the one I wanted. Yeah. It, it's, it's okay, but it's not the one I wanted. Yeah, Super Bowl. Okay, so now, so now I'm just gonna walk around all day and do this. When was the last time you played with the Super Bowl? All right, here we go, we got the pizza. Pizza, pizza, pizza. And we both got the same thing, right? Yeah. I can smell it through these little holes right here. It smells good. So we got the pizza that is the name of the ride, right? Yeah. What's it called? It's called Tondemina. Tondemina. Because it's got the schlong on it. <laughs> it's got... He said schlong! Oh, can you believe this? Okay, go in for a bite. Go ahead, guys. Have a bite. The rest is ours. Don't shake the table. Don't shake the table. No touching the table. Unstable. Mine is stuck to the box. Yours too? Mine too. It's, uh, oh, it's heavy. There's definitely some volume going on here. Look at that. Huh? Make sure when you look at the, you look here if you're gonna look at the camera. Don't look up there. Okay. All right, ready? Yep. In three, two, one. Mmm. Nice wiener. Mm. It's cheesy, mm. isn't it? A lot of cheese on here. And this is uh, its really thin crust. Super thin crust. Maybe that's why it feels like there's a lot of cheese on it. Yeah? Yeah. And stringy too, huh? Yeah. Oh boy. What toppings are you tasting? 
most uh, cheese. Cheese. And cheese they're is good. The cheese is good. Yeah, I agree. A lot of cheese. There's onions. I'm tasting onions. Mm-hmm. And um, there's potato on this pizza for some reason. There's potato. Mm -hmm. Like a lot of potatoes. Scalloped potatoes. Um. Why would you put potatoes on a pizza? I don't think the potatoes go with pizza. Don't shake the table. <laughs> no. See, look, here's a potato right here. It just fell out. Potato. Yeah. Did you grab some napkins? No. Neither did I. <laughs> but I think, you know, messy pizza is good pizza. Would you agree? Yeah. If your pizza's not a little bit messy, then it's not real pizza. Mm. How's the sausage? It's pretty good. It's pretty good, isn't it? Mm-hmm. Good overall flavor. Mm-hmm. It's got some bang to it. Bang, I mean spiciness, right? A little yep. bit. Okay. Finger check. <coughs> Alright, who wins the finger? Who wins the messy fingers contest? <laughs> oh boy. There it is. <coughs> well that was pretty good. I was hungry. More hungry than I thought after riding that awful ride. Now, so uh, I'll let you go ahead and rate it first. Now you can rate the Pizzata Pizza. I believe Pizzata is the number one pizza chain in Japan. I think so. I give it a six. A six, he's going nom nom nom. Wow. I'm gonna have to give it a five, a little bit less, only a five, because I didn't like the potato on it. I don't think potato belongs on a pizza. But hey, that's just me. But it was still really good. That's still a nom nom and a nom 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 for this guy. So six star ranking. Anytime there's a six star ranking in, in my videos, you know what that means, guys. You leave a comment down below and at the uh, end of the video, I give, I give away three of the get some snack packs in the following video. So you leave a comment and uh, that's how you enter for your chance to win. So go ahead and do that. But this video is not over yet. We are, it's far from over. We haven't done any roller coasters yet. So what should we ride next? Um, the Takabisha. Okay, that's that's the one that goes, goes like this. The roller coaster is coming down and then it goes in and then back out. It's So you're upside down. Uh, it's hard to explain, but you'll see it. The wait time, I think, is 100 minutes for that. So what are we going to do in line? I don't know what I'm going to do. I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to play with my Super Bowl. Yes. What are you going to do? <laughs> I don't know. All right. Let's go get some napkins. All right. We'll see you guys in a minute. I got to go wash my hands. What do we have over here? This is a virtual reality attraction. We'll do that next. What'd you think? Oh, it was good. It was pretty good. We, we basically went on a virtual reality tour of the Fujiyama roller coaster. Pretty cool. Yeah. yeah, what would you rate it? I'd give it three. Three. Yeah, I'm gonna give it the same. Mine stopped midway through and uh, I saw a Galaxy, it was rebooting, so I only got to see half of it. So, yeah, it's a meh. But pretty cool though how you can look around, right? Hey yo, have you tried donor kebab? No, but let's try it. All right. Oh, look at that. Look at that. That looks good. Mm. We need something to drink with these kebabs. What are you going to get? I'll get it. Apple. 
apple tea. Oh, tea's tea. That's good stuff. That's from New York. Yeah. Good stuff. Good choice. I don't know. So many choices. I don't know what I feel like. Maybe just some Fuji mineral water. Mount Fuji mineral water. Jasmine tea. That's pretty nice. A little girly. Uh, let's come over here. That's what I'm getting. Pocari sweat. Pocari sweat. Okay. Let's eat. How come you got the big one? Yours definitely has way more meat. Look, look guys. His is, he's got, he's got twice as much meat inside of his. This isn't fair. Right? Yeah. There's twice as much meat in his. It's not fair. All right. So the cost for these was uh, about $4.50 each. Not bad. And we got the spicy, the hot, for the sauce. Hope it's not too hot. Ready? Go. It's pretty spicy. Mm -hmm. Right? I think I should have got the mild, or the garlic. It's pretty spicy. Well, I don't know. The meat's all gone in mine. You still got meat left? Yeah. Not fair. Not fair. Okay. Okay, girl alert. I don't know. This is pretty boring at the end for me. It's just cabbage on a dry piece of non bread. White or a, what is it, pizza? It needs more sauce down at the bottom. But yours looks, I don't know, different. I think you just got a better one. Mine was disappointing. And I've had these a lot in Japan where they've been really, really good, so. Disappointing. I'm gonna give, have to give it a nah, it's a two. Only a two. I think I'm gonna have to drink some Pokari sweat to wash it down. So how was yours? You're still chewing it? Mm hmm See? He definitely had more volume in his. And they were the same price, the exact same item. Really good. This is basically, it's a, it's a Gatorade. And it's good. It's good. What else can I say about it? You know, it's a bit, it's sweet, it's a bit salty. It's, it's a, uh, it's a body fluids, body fluids, uh, What's the word I'm looking for? It's a body fluids replenisher. That's what it is, yeah. It's like Gatorade, but better, I think. Not as sweet. Yeah. What do you got to drink? Tea's tea, apple. Hmm. I've never tried that one. Is it hot or cold? It's cold. It's cold? I wonder if they serve that one hot, too. So in the winter, you can get a lot of hot drinks out of vending machines, which is a really nice thing to have when it's cold. Does it taste like real apples? Yeah. No? Yeah. Sweet? The smell is good. The smell is good. Let me yeah. smell it. Yeah, it does. It smells like apples for sure. Not bad. And are you going to rate your uh, kebab? I give it a four. Four, a no. Okay. Do you like the overall flavor? Yeah. yeah. I thought the meat wasn't that fresh. You know, normally... They're cutting it off of the, uh, you know, the, the cylinder-like thing that goes around. What's it called? That's the kebab, right? That's the donor kebab, right? It's going around. There. But they had theirs in a pot, so that meat, you know, had been cut a long time ago. I, I thought it was maybe a little bit hard, the meat, yeah. right? It wasn't really very tender. So, yeah, two for me. It's a nah, forget it. I'm going to search for a better donor kebab place in Tokyo somewhere, I think, and I'll, I'll show you guys that. Yeah, so watch for it. All right, so what's next? What are we doing next? We have to ride a roller coaster. Yeah. Yeah, roller coaster's next. All right, let's go. Hey, Mega Brain, what are you doing? I have to get a Super Bowl. 
I told you. I told you you were going to want one. Can you figure out Blue's Clues? What'd you get? What'd you get? It's like a, it's like SpongeBob, but without the pants. <laughs> SpongeBob without pants. Okay, does it work? Bounce it. Happy New Year. Got your very own Super Bowl. So we are in line for what's the name of this roller coaster? Takabisha. Takabisha. And this is what it does. It comes down like this. And then it wraps around and goes under like that. You know? And there's the course. I don't know. It's freaky. Yeah. It uses advanced mathematics, so you know it's going to be good. Yeah. Higher than Tokyo Tower. Yeah. Have you ridden this before? No. Never? Yeah. Okay, good. Me too, first time. So, how, how long is the wait time on this? 60 minutes. 60 minutes? So you got something to do? Yeah. Just playing with our balls. Check this guy out. He's sitting on a chair. He's not sitting anymore. <laughs> That's funny. I want a chair. Do you want a chair? Yeah. <laughs> Well, I guess I guess we'll have to buy some chairs for next time. It's pretty smart, actually, to wait for an hour standing up or to sit in a chair. What would you guys do? Guinness, no way! This roller coaster is in the Guinness Book. The steepest roller coaster is the Takabisha, with a 121 degree free fall, which is located at Fujikyu Highland. Blah, 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 blah. Wow! 121 degree free fall. What does that even mean? Is that it? No, no, no. Okay. Part one, done. <laughs> one more part to go. Oh. Oh, oh what is this? <laughs> what is uh, this? Oh, man. The main event. Oh, my. Oh. Oh, my. Oh. Oh, oh, oh man. Going vertical. Oh. This is intense. <laughs> this is intense. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> Now what? <laughs> what happens? Uh, oh, look at that, look at that. Oh, 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 slow. Okay, this okay, is good. This is good. Okay. okay, okay, okay. This is good, this is comfortable. Kim was here, eh? Kim was here. Six out of six. Six out of six. It's thick. Nom nom nom. We're at the Moss Burger and this is the Fujiyama Burger right there. It's a double decker burger and it's got chili sauce on it. Yeah. What do you think? You want to get one of those? Yep. All right. Let's go for it. Happy 
New Year. It's dinner time. Yep, here we go. We've got Moss Burgers. Can you guys see these? I can't see them because I got these silly glasses on. <laughs> can you guys see this? Uh, I think, can you see through those glasses? No. That's much better. All right. Okay, so these are the infamous Fujiyama Burger from Moss Burger, Japan. And I believe these are only served at this location. It's a special burger for the amusement park. So, grab a burger. Yeah. And let's see if we can uh, show you a close up here. Oh, it's, it's, a, it's like a tower burger, right? It's, it's doubled. This is, you show them? Look at that. I think mine looks better. Yeah, look at that. At least one's enough maybe. So it's, it's definitely a, a good sized burger. Yep, and the price for this is only about six bucks. Not bad. All right, let's dig in. This is a chili burger. Ready? Let's make it happen. Hmm. My first bite was a bit dry. I didn't get any chili. Did you? No. No? I'm <clears throat> going in for bite number two. Still didn't get any chili. It's, the chili's all down in the bottom here. Hmm. What do you think? Pretty good tasting burger. Mm -hmm. Not bad, right? I like the meat. <clears throat> okay, right here. Here's the chili right here. Right here. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Mouthful of chili. Oh, that's good. Right? Mm -hmm. It's but it's very mild chili. It's not hot at all, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it's also got onions on it. I'm tasting a lot of onions. Diced onions and uh, tomato. There's cheese on here. Some mayonnaise. What else? Lettuce, of course. And it's messy. It's definitely messy. Oh. Right? Yeah. You're eating yours pretty clean. Okay. So we gotta eat fast because. The amusement park's only open for another hour and a half. So we want to try to get in one more roller coaster and then maybe some, some kitty rides, just for fun. Well, and we're also gonna have one more meal, I think, right? Yeah. Yeah, we'll probably do one more meal before this video's over. So keep watching. This has really been a fun day, hasn't it? I think the most enjoyable part of my day has been this ball right here. I have had so much fun with the Super Bowl. I like the simple things in life. What drink did you get? Is this your drink? What is yeah. that? Is that ginger ale? Yeah. Okay. Looks like beer. Looks like Bud Light. <laughs> I've got uh, udon cha, Chinese tea. No sugar. No. <laughs> Clear. You do? Yeah. We finished at the same time. All right. Should we rate them now or should we eat the fries first? What do you think? Rate them. You want to rate right away? Yeah. Okay. So uh, the, the Fujiyama, uh, the Fujiyama <laughs> Burger at Moss Burger. And we're at FujiQ Highland Amusement Park. What are you going to give it on the one to six? I give it five stars. Five. Five out of six. That's a nom nom. I'm gonna give it the same, five out of six. It's it's not a perfect burger, but it's certainly delicious, for sure. And pretty good value, I think. So, yeah, five out of six. I would def definitely recommend it if you come here. In fact, all the food here is pretty good, right? <clears throat> yeah. Food is pretty special here, I think, if you're into, you know, Western-style stuff. And fair, fairly good prices, too. It's not that expensive. So, last thing we need to try are these, what do you call these, potato chips? Potato, 
What are they called? In Japan, this is called potato fry. They're french fries. Yeah. Okay. And they gave us just this tiny little bit of ketchup. I guess I could get more, but... All right, let's go. Thick, thick cut. This one's a little limp. <laughs> mm -hmm. They're really, um... They're fluffy on the inside. Nice texture. They're salted pretty well. Actually, they don't even need ketchup, actually, right? Yeah. Pretty good fry. Do you prefer these french fries or McDonald's? Which, which, which do you like better? McDonald's. Yeah, same here. It's really tough to beat McDonald's french fries. Would you guys agree? McDonald's just makes amazing french fries. Is there a better french fry out there? I don't know. Let me know in the comments if, if there is. I'd like to try it. Of course, if you put something on top of fries, like cheese or chili or something, like, then it's different, right? Like animal style fries at In N Out Burger. That's way better than McDonald's, right? Yeah. Or <clears throat> the chili fries at Tommy Burgers in California. Well, just for a standard French fry, standalone French fry by itself, McDonald's, mm -hmm. right? Yeah, I was complaining about them not giving me enough ketchup. We didn't even use any of it. <laughs> we use all of it right now. <laughs> oh, the ketchup is amazing. I should have used it the whole time. Just dip your finger in there to get a try it. Just a little bit. Mm. Right? It's really it's like ketchup. rich, rich, thick, tangy. Mossburger ketchup. For the win. What are you gonna rate the fries? This is, today is like a really special day because it's New Year's. We're rating anything and everything that we encounter, as you've seen in the video. <laughs> four, you're giving it a four. Four for the fries. I'm gonna give the fries a five. And if you added ketchup, they might be a six. Well, but five. McDonald's, that's a six, right? Yeah. Yeah. Just the fries. Oh. <laughs> and, and the sausage egg McMuffin thing I had this morning. All right. Let's go ride another roller coaster. What's the name of this ride? It's Ejanaika. What does that mean? It means something like, uh, what in the world? WTF? Something like that. Yeah, because it's got 14 rotations in it. Incredible. It's just, right? Yeah. yeah. And how long is this line? You looked it up on the app. It's like 50 minutes. 50 minutes? Okay, so we'll be bouncing our balls again and uh, maybe I'll do some magic tricks. 50 minutes. This might be the last one. What do you think? Yeah, we'll see. Oh, dark! Dark! Oh, no! It's dark! It's so dark! It's so dark! Oh, going up! Oh, boy.
Oh, 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 oh. Six. Definitely yeah. a six. Cool six, sir. Six. Oh, yeah. Six. Man, that was intense. That was really, really intense. Yeah? Yeah. Best ride in the park, as far as I'm concerned. Definitely the best ride in the park. Did you think so? Yeah. Yeah? It's the big. But we still got a little bit of time left. What do we got? How much time left? We got we got 45 minutes left. So can you guys hang in there for a couple more rides? Can you? Can you? Huh? Huh? <laughs> and we're gonna bounce balls and vending machines. I want some corn soup. That's what I want. Yeah, we're riding the swing. So oh, it's going! It's going too low. I thought this was gonna be mellow. Oh, this is, this is pretty heavy. Yeah. pocket now and uh with the done with the camera what are you gonna give it I give it five five I'm gonna give it uh, I'll give it a I don't even know it's so cold okay now it's about now that it's mellowing out I also give it a five it's a gnome gnome so it's just after seven o'clock the amusement park is closed we're in the gift shop on our way out and I'm gonna pick up some Thomas goods now yeah, chocolate chip cookies mm, what else I got Oh, yeah. Oh, it's a bus. No way. <laughs> but Thomas is a train, not a bus. This is lame. I'm totally getting it. I'm totally getting it. This is sad, but we gotta go home. This is the exit right here. Let's go, bro. Oh. All right, so on behalf of myself and this guy, who are you? Mega Brand 6200. 6 <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching, and there's a giveaway, right? Yeah. You know, there's been so many six ratings in this video. I think <laughs> we need to give away more, actually. Since this is the end of the video, we're going to give away six of the Get Some Snack Packs. Six. You can pack them up for me. Actually, he's going to buy the stuff that goes in these six, so it's, it's going to be special. I'm making new ones for the uh, New Year's. So uh, just leave a comment down below, and uh, you'll be qualified to win, right? Yeah. And uh, let me know if you guys want to see more of this guy in the videos, all right? And uh, that's it. Say goodbye. Goodbye. Peace, guys. Happy New Year. Ha, ha, ha.